Hey, what's up? To get the power save, go to Amazon.com, then go to the PowerSaves.com website, download the drivers, and you're pretty much good to go. Everything is plug and play, and it even comes with its own USB connector, so there's nothing for you to worry about. For your convenience, I left the link in the description, and now, let's get to the guide. What's up, YouTube? This is Dragon, and this is a guide on how to get any move you want in Pokemon. Yes, it can be done very fast, and this guide will show you exactly how it's done. So. Let's start off with Azumarill for example, and as we can see here, all this Azumarill knows is Focus Blast. Now while that may be pretty cool to see, I'm sure Azumarill's can have, you know, better moves than just Focus Blast. So what we're going to do, we're going to take this Azumarill and we're going to put her in Box 1, Slot 1. And you're going to see very soon the importance of putting the Pokemon in Box 1, Slot 1. Okay, so now we're going to save the game. And from here, we're going to just close the game out and take it from out of the 3DS and put it within the power saves device right here. So, just like that. Okay, now from here, I'm going to go into the code section. And what we're going to do, we're going to manipulate the amount of items that we have. So, max item codes. We're going to click on that. Then, the items that we want to manipulate are the items within slot 2, 3, 4, and 5. Those are the sections that we want. Now, why are we doing this? Well, let's just scroll down here. And it should be right here move modifier codes box one slot one now as you can see here it says the two item codes for x99 in slot two three four five then discard the required number so basically right here item slot two equals move one slot three equals move two and you know so forth and so forth and then you have the four moves that you want to teach your pokemon now your next question may be okay well where are these moves and how do I actually make sense of this? Well, this is a very simple thing and I'm going to show you how it's done. So, what you do is you go to, let's just say you, you know, go to Google and from here you just type in, oh, that's, well, that's, no. Okay, um, come on move okay pokemon move list right here and this is the list of moves in the bobopedia so now every single move in the game corresponds to a particular hmm, every move in the game corresponds to a particular index number that's within the game itself so let's say you want to have the move aqua jet for your azumarill so what you do is press Control f for um, finding the move quickly and you put in a Q U A J E T. Okay, so Aqua Jet. As we can see, Aqua Jet is move number 453 within the index of the game itself. So, what we need to do for the first move is to. Hmm, so, let's say we have, you know, 999. 999 items because you have the move aqua jet as 453 you want to discard um i did the math already um you want to discard 546 of the items and then you will end up with 453 of uh, 453 items within um slot one or four well for the particular move slot so that's aqua jet so let's say let uh superpower that's another interesting move for azumaru so let's see s-u-p-e-r-p-o-w 276 right here okay so let's see another one play rough that's a good one r-o-u 583 okay and belly drum let's see belly drum b-e why 187 okay so I did all the math already so that's a bit of a preemption because that would have been a lot of math to have done so that's pretty much that there and that's it 
So now we know exactly the amount of items that we have to discard. And from here, um, I'm just going to click apply so that I can give myself the 999 items for each of the particular moves that I would need. Okay, so it's doing the uploading, downloading of the save, and that's that. So now we're going to take the game out of the Power Saves device and put it back within our 3DS. All right. Now, don't worry. This is just going to take a very short time. We just have to wait for the game to load. All right. And this is much faster than doing, you know, all types of breeding. Because breeding can take um, maybe even days, especially when it comes to an Ozmaro and getting all the perfect stats. So, let's see. And a lot of these are egg moves, especially the um, Belly Drum and the Aqua Jet. Those are two be um, egg moves. So, slot one. No, it's not, not slot one. Slot two is Evolite. So, that will be the first move. Okay, so we're going to discard... <clears throat> the amount for aqua jet which will be 546 okay let's see do, 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 do. 546 there we go okay now for slot two is when i say slot two you know what i mean slot two within the move slot that is superpower which is 723 that we need to discard okay Three. There we go. And for slot three, let's see. Play rough is discard 416. So, hmm. 416. There we are. And for the last one, that is belly drum, which means 812. Okay. So. 12. There we go. Okay. So. Now from here, we're going to save the game again. Alright. And. Boom. Close out the game real quick. Alright. And take the game. Put it back into the power saves device and now what we're going to do we're going to go back to that section that says move modifier codes box one slot one so let's just go over it one more time they said discard the required number for moves for a list for a list type pokemon list of moves um type pokemon list of moves in the browser and that's pretty much what we did so um we're going to just do all of them individually because that's I guess it would be a bit more convenient in a sense if you could select them all but nonetheless you know we're just going to do them one by one I mean it's much faster than you know breeding for hours and hours or even days and I personally I bred an Ozumaro that had um, a whole I think it had like two egg moves and I had to do all types of stuff. I had to get like a, um, you know, what's that Pokemon that looks like it has like, a, um, it's like a water type and it looks like it has like a, a Flotzo. Yes, yeah, so I had to get a Flotzo in order to um, get the egg move for um, Aqua Jet. Yes. And that took me quite a long time. Then on top of that, you know, you have to make sure that each breeding uh, passing on, you know, has the particular IVs and EVs that are matching. Uh, no, not EV, sorry. I mean, IVs. So, yeah, I mean, this is, oh man, this is much faster. It's just unbelievably faster. Okay. So, looks like that is all said and done, and we now have all in. Um, yeah, I was going to increase the items to 999 again, just in case um, I want to do some more moves. But that's, you know, neither here nor there. So now, I'm just going to put the game back inside, and we're going to see how it affected the Azumarill. Alright. 
Oh, okay. And the game will load eventually. So let's see. Now we're going to go inside of our box and boot the PC. And let's see. Azumarill has the moves that we wanted. Aqua Jet, Superpower, Play Rough, and Belly Drum. There we go. Let's just do a quick summary to see if yeah, this is it. Aqua Jet, Superpower, Play Rough, and Belly Drum. Each within the particular sections that we designated the moves to be. So, as you can see, it is much faster to do it this way because it just is. I mean, instead of breeding and, you know, getting all these different Pokemon, you can just put the moves on there that the Pokemon will learn anyway, and you're all good to go. Now, I know that this is pretty cool, so what I also did in conjunction with this, I also made a video on how to get any competitive Pokemon that you want in less than 15 minutes. And yes, just like this, it can be done just as fast. Well, I'm glad that you watched this video, and I will see you in the next one. See you later.